Castleberry and LaFleur back deep. It is Jared Zirkel kicking off, and we're underway. Muffed. Fair catch was called for, but he's getting an earful here as a starter for the first time. Deep handoff to Franklin. Finds some room. He's going to get across the 20 for a first down. Tanks lay in motion. Inside handoff to Franklin. Finds some room up the middle. And it's a good run on third down, but still a long way short of where they needed to get. Indicator to the quarterback. Pressure coming off the edge. Picked up nicely by the offensive line. And that is complete at the 38-yard line. Dominic Lovett, the big transfer portal pickup from Mizzou. And you're going to see a lot of that this season. Playing in the slot, something that he was very comfortable in. Last year for Missouri, great job with the extension. Perfect ball placement, but I think that's an incompletion there. Holding, defense, number 20. That's a 10-yard penalty from the previous spot. Automatic, first down. Just two passing yards so far for Carson Beck. He's two for four throwing. Look at her throw here, dumps it off short. There is Bowers. Bowers slips through a tackle. Into UT Martin territory. That's Brock Bowers, the reigning Mackey Award winner, and a flag comes in late. He has the name recognition. Personal foul. Play hit out of bounds. Defense, number 20. From the 20 yard line, third down and seven. And right on time is Carson Beck. That's going to be a first down. Cedric Van Pran coming back, the center. That was a big lift for this team. And there is Bowers, touchdown. First touchdown of the year goes to the Mackey winner, Brock Bowers. 10 plays, 73 yards at 439. The one thing that, that continues to jump off the film when you watch 19, and you saw it on the first completion, the, the, the rollout from Carson Beck, you hit the, the, the tight end in the flat. Kincaid Dant getting heated up, trying to step out of trouble, and he can't. He's swallowed up. Michael Williams. One play mentality. Todd Munkin went back to the NFL, new offensive coordinator, new quarterback. This is more like what the fans want to see. Kendall Milton stepping it into the secondary. Big gallop to the 31-yard line. You're, you're looking for him. It's going to be definitely running back by committee. Looking for Bowers. They got him again. That's going to be a first down and more. Brock Bowers takes a hit and then leaves some punishment of his own and gets to the 13-yard line. They're going to motion someone over to take that double team off of him. Back all kinds of time. Now he's going to run. Nice move into the end zone, touchdown. That's got to feel good for Carson Beck. How many times did this crowd over the last couple of years see Stetson Bennett do things very similar to that? Oh, Stetson had a little wiggle, wiggle, wiggle on him, and Carson Beck saying, I, got, I learned a little something else. And go back to the ground, tripped up, coming through was Cash Jones. Beck, over the middle, there's Bowers again, first down and more to midfield. Catch number five for Bowers. 48 seconds to go in the half. George out of timeouts. Beck has time, now runs out of it. Now steps up, and he is going to be stopped short of the first down marker. Tevin Ship, the linebacker, stepped up and made the tackle. Are they going to give it to him? They're going to say he got enough. Clock running. First down from the 40. Beck on the crossing route. Got it to Jones. He's going to step out of bounds wisely to stop the clock. Beck. Going downfield, caught inside the five. What a catch in tough coverage by Lovett. Come out, have a better second half, hopefully. Back, plenty of time. Goes to the end zone. Man open in the back, and it's incomplete. He wanted Arian Smith, who was right there. The longest field goal in state history last year, 60 yards. So he's got a strong leg, and he bangs it home to make it 17 to nothing. Muse and Georgia deep. Who's that finesse you're talking about? In the corner. Mercy! At the two-yard line, it's dead for Aiden LaRosse. This game might even be more interesting. Flared out on first down. 
And it is caught, a little tunnel screen. This is the first time we've talked about C.J. Smith tonight, a first down reception as Bowers goes in motion. Play action pass rolling out on the run. Beck is complete and inside the 35-yard line, Dylan Bell. Kai Muse swings out of the backfield. And he's going to get it on the screen. Muse tucks inside. There he goes, Makai Muse. Look up. One man to beat. Touchdown. <laughs> 54 yards. Makai Muse explosive after the catch. He's earned the right to play. His work ethic has been incredible this offseason. And right from day one this season, having other plans, he wants to be very involved in the offense. After this play, it looks like he should be. Well, once again, you, you, we go back to what we talk about with the receivers. You bring in these transfer receivers, and you already have a pretty good group. Andrew Paul in the backfield. Take the handoff to him. Here's Carson Beck. Clean in the pocket, man. Wide open. Here we go. Into plus territory, C.J. Smith. Finally brought down inside the 35. More times than not. Here's Beck rolling out. Now he stops, throws it downfield. Here's Muse again. Muse spins inside the 10. First down and goal to go. Georgia from the 8. On opening night. And that's an easy touchdown. Robinson walks right in. And now Georgia's got some separation. Play fake. Can Kate Dent complete? That's going to be a first down close to midfield. Quarter at home, too, so it just shows you, you know, teams take some time to get some rhythm on offense, especially with some new weapons for both Alabama, new quarterback there as well, with Jalen Miro getting the start. Some room. Franklin stiff arm steps out. Along the sideline, did he get it? Yes, he did. First down out of the hold of Cody Sparks, the backup quarterback. Low snap, kick is up, and it is no good. His first career start in Georgia. And now Brock Vandegrift trying to move the offense. He's going to take a deep shot. Looking for Ron Ron Thomas. He's got Ron Ron inside the 20-yard line. Biggest play for Georgia tonight, 56 yards. Now Vandegrift, again, wide open man, Delp, what a catch! And then dropped it. But they're gonna call it a touchdown. He held on long enough. Oscar Delp, at the top of his shoes, makes the catch with his back to the end zone and falls in for the touchdown. Oh, they love this, whether it's faking a screen or, or right there, a pitch to the outside, yeah. He had enough movement and then stretching it over, completed the catch. See right there, ball's completed. Made a athletic move to stretch the ball over the pylon. Any one of those teams could take him down. Kincaid Dent sprinting out, throwing on the run, has him at it. He's complete to one day for the first down. A ton of skill, speed. Trying to pick it up. And defense rallying to the football. It looks like UT Martin picked it up. Watch the tape, see what you did wrong, get coached. Here's Kincaid Dent sprinting out. He has shown that he can run with efficiency. He's got the talent. They know that. He just, every game is going to be a little bit better than this quarterback for UT Martin. Here's Dent again throwing on the run. He seems to do that very well, too. Efficient, but it's week one and you're up 38 nothing. So, Dent. what do we call it? Champagne problems? Yeah. They'll take it, I'm sure. Castleberry. Yeah. Kirby is such a perfectionist. Dent lobbing it to the corner. And it is off the hand. Did he catch it? That is a catch. Travante Rucker. He did hold on. That is a touchdown in the corner for Travante Rucker, the junior from Ocala, Florida. As a quarterback, you throw it in a bucket in the corner. And he threw it in the bucket. I don't now, know if he in. Did he complete that catch? Yeah. Boy, I don't know. I don't know, and the fans are seeing it on the Jumbotron, and they don't think so. Here's another look, probably our best angle. The touchdown is under video review. He's got the tip. I don't know if he's secured it yet. Oh. After video review, the ruling of a touchdown stands. Not as big as the other two quarterbacks physically. 6'1", 215. 
Here are the feet. Look at him go. First down. And he gets close to the 40-yard line. Gunner Stockton out of Tiger, Georgia. Out of the huddle, Gunner Stockton from the shotgun. Play fake. He'll swing it out. This is Anthony Evans, a freshman out of Converse, Texas, getting the catch. But things have kind of come together here in the second half. This is the third quarterback we're seeing for Georgia. Gunner Stockton standing tall in the pocket, steps up, throws on the run, right on the screws to Zee Haynes. Stockton, complete, and that's going to be another first down for Georgia. For Georgia and the coaching staff, you know, another opportunity to continue to, to work this young team in certain areas. That is good. So Peyton Woodring having a nice debut as a Georgia Bulldog. Cody Sparks into the game for the first time at quarterback. Kincaid Dent is done. And his first pass is picked off. Kyron Jones taking it to the house. A pick six here in Athens. How about that debut for the true freshman from Charlotte?